do you find yourself getting involved in one controlling relationship after another? Understanding yourself and what drives the controlling behavior of others will help you break the pattern of these relationships. Here are four common ways why you might keep getting involved with controlling and emotionally abusive partners. One, if you've experienced emotional neglect or trauma in the past, you might unknowingly seek partners who feel familiar in their unpredictability and emotional distance. This can be a subconscious attempt to fix unresolved pain through current relationships. Two, you might have self-sabotaging ways of thinking about yourself and others. If you have low self-esteem or a distorted self-image, you might believe that you don't deserve better treatment or that abusive behavior is a normal part of love. This misguided thinking can make it hard to recognize red flags that will keep you from getting involved with abusive people. Three, ignoring your intuition also may lead you into a troubled relationship. If you've grown used to doubting your feelings and perceptions, you might overlook early signs of emotional abuse. Trusting yourself and listening to your gut feelings when something feels off can be difficult if you've learned to discount your instincts. Four, running from loneliness and unresolved feelings can also lead you into the arms of the wrong person. The fear of being alone might push you to jump into relationships without really knowing the character or intentions of the person with whom you're getting involved. When someone presents themselves with a lot of charm and promises early on, it can be very seductive, especially if you're feeling vulnerable. If you can recognize your self-sabotaging patterns of behavior, you can start working on evaluating yourself and your feelings. As you get to know yourself better and act on your instincts, get involved with activities that make you happy. It will help you trust your intuition and recognize the qualities in healthy, supportive relationships. Building a strong sense of self may require being single for a while to understand yourself better, but you'll be in a much better position to find a loving, supportive partner.